Hey guys, I saw this discussion yesterday, and after I figured out how to join the forum or this group, I uh, thought I'd chime in. Um, and somebody had mentioned the shuffle, so I thought we could go over that and kind of how I do the shuffle. Um, you see, I have a four string here, but we're going to forget about the low, the highest string, and we're just going to concentrate on the three lowest strings. G D G, so just like a three stringer, open G. Um, and this, if you're tuned to open A or open D or E or whatever. The fingerings are all the same. You're just going to be playing it in a different key. So it's all the same. Um, so the shuffle. Uh, if we're talking like 12 bar blues, um, it's really pretty simple. We're going to play, you can play all the strings if you want to. And you want to get a rhythm going with your picking hand. Just like that. So to make it the shuffle, we have to incorporate the second fret of the, your middle string on your three stringer, which in this case the D string. So we get that rhythm going and we're going to add that in there. Okay, simple enough. And we got to change chords and go to the second chord, which would be, in this case, a C chord. It doesn't matter. All that matters is you're on the fifth. You're moving up to the fifth fret. So here you're going to take your index finger and you're going to put it fret all three of your strings with your index finger. That takes a little strength and getting used to, but it's not bad. So we're going to do the same thing. Two frets up from that on the middle string, we're going to fret it just like we did before, but we have to use our ring finger to do that. So we're going, we'll be fretting the middle string on the seventh fret while holding all of our strings down at the fifth fret. And then back down to Okay. Then we're going to move up from there, we're going to move up to the 7th fret, do the same thing we did, fret the middle string on the ninth fret. Move down to the 5th and the 7th, and back to your open position. So, uh, let me do that, I'm going to count through the 12 bars, and we'll put that all together, and then I'll show you a little extra embellishment you can do. So we go one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, six, two, three, four, seven, two, three, four, eight, two, three, four, nine, two, three, four, ten, two, three, four, eleven, two, three, four. Okay, so the little embellishment you can do is you can add, you can add going from the second fret to the third fret on that second string, or up here it would be from the seventh fret to the eighth, or the ninth fret to the tenth. So let me just run through that real quick. Okay, so I added something else in there too. On that final twelfth bar, instead of staying down here, for, this would be the eleventh bar, twelfth bar. We we go back up to that seventh fret for a little bit of a turnaround. So.
So there you go. Hopefully that's a pretty basic 12-bar blues shuffle lesson for you, and I hope that helps, and we'll see you guys later.